Hello, how to solve for a in this equation a square minus a to the power of 3 is equal to 150. Solution. Then here we have a square minus a to the power of 3. If you take this 150 to this side, it becomes minus 150 is equal to zero we have a square minus a to the power of 3 minus 150 can be written as minus 125 minus 25 is equal to zero then we have a square minus a to the power of 3 minus 125 can be written as minus 5 to the power of 3 and minus 25 can be written as minus 5 square is equal to 0. Now we can pair this with this and let's pair this with this. We have a square minus 5 square then minus here it will be a to the power of 3 plus 5 to the power of 3 is equal to 0. Now, if you look at this, this is in the form of perfect square, and this can be written as if you have s square minus y square, this is equal to s plus y bracket s minus y also if you have s to the power of 3 plus y to the power of 3 this is equal to s plus y bracket bracket we have s square minus x y plus y square and from here, x is equal to a, and then y is equal to 5. This can be written as a plus 5 bracket a minus 5 minus, here we have a plus 5 bracket bracket a square minus 5 multiplied by a plus 5 square is equal to 0 then we have a plus 5 bracket bracket a minus 5 minus here we have a plus 5 bracket a square minus 5 times a 5a plus 5 square that is 25 is equal to 0 then if you look at this here and here a plus 5 is common here and a plus 5 is common let's bring it out we have a plus 5 bracket then bracket if you divide this by this we have a minus 5 then minus if you divide this by this we have a square minus 5a plus 25 is equal to 0 then we have a plus 5 bracket and here is a minus 5 minus if you op minus multiply by a squared it will be minus a square minus times minus 5a will be plus 5a Minus times 
plus 25, that will be minus 25, is equal to 0. Here we have a plus 5, bracket, then bracket here will be a plus 5a, that is 6a, minus 5, minus 25, that is 30, and then we have minus a square plus 6a minus 30 is equal to 0. Here, there are two cases here. The first case is a plus 5 is equal to 0. And the second case is minus a square plus 6a minus 30 is equal to 0. Then from here, a is equal to minus 5. Let's call this a1. And from here, we have minus a square plus 6a minus 30 is equal to 0. We can divide all through by minus 1. Then if you divide by minus 1, minus a square divided by minus 1, this will give you a square. Then plus 6a divided by minus 1, this will give you minus 6a. And minus 30 divided by minus 1, this will be plus 30 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. And our quadratic general formula is given as a is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. Then where a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 6, and then c is equal to 30. Then here we have a is equal to minus bracket minus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 all square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 30 divided by 2 multiply by 1. Then here we have a is equal to minus times minus 6 that is plus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square that is 36 minus 4 multiply by 1 multiply by 30 that is minus 120 divided by 2 multiplied by 1, that is 2. Then a is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 120, that is minus 84, divided by 2. Now we have a is equal to 6 plus or minus Minus 84 can be written as square root of 21 multiplied by 4 multiplied by minus 1 divided by 2. Then A is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 multiplied by square root of 21 multiplied by square root of minus 1 divided by 2 then a is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 that is 2 root 21 i because square root of minus 1 is i then divided by 2 
then a is equal to 6 divided by 2 plus or minus 2 divided by 2 square root of 21 i now 2 here 1 2 here 3 2 here 1 2 here 1 a is equal to 3 plus or minus i root 21 so a2 is equal to 3 plus i root 21 and uh, a3 is equal to 3 minus i root 21. We can see that these are complex solution. Our final answers are A1 is equal to minus 5 then A2 is equal to 3 plus I square root of 21 and then A3 is equal to 3 minus I square root of 21 we have this as complex root and this also is a complex root now we can check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong let's check to check we are going to check using this a is equal to minus 5 to check, we have the given equation a square minus a to the power of 3 is equal to 150. When a is equal to minus 5, we have minus 5 square minus bracket minus 5 to the power of 3 must be equal to 150 then minus 5 squared this is 25 minus bracket minus 5 to the power of 3 that is minus 125 must be equal to 150 then here we have 25 Minus times minus, that is plus 125, must be equal to 150. Now, 25 plus 125, this is 150, is equal to 150, which is true as A is equal to minus 5. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.